It's been super long since I've done any vlog videos. So today, because the puppies, some of the puppies are leaving this weekend. It's, this has gone by so fast. Um, but some of the puppies are leaving this weekend. So I figured if I'm gonna get a vlog episode, with all 25 puppies, I better do it today. Um, today actually is gonna be a super slow day for us. Um, we don't have any appointments, we don't have any meetings with any customers or um, new puppy owners. So um, it's it's gonna be a really, <laughs> really calm, slow day, but a day we can focus on the puppies, so that's good. Well, I was sleeping in this morning. Uh, Brian took care of everything downstairs, but I'm just gonna tell you what our process is instead of show you because I was sleeping. So at night we have the puppies in the pen and back here is like their sleeping area and we opened up the pen so that it goes all the way along the entire thing so all the puppies are together the whole time. So this is like their sleeping area. That is kind of like a play slash toilet area and then all the way in the back we also have some litter boxes um, and it's just and it's more open for play. But when they wake up in the morning we let them outside and they all go to the bathroom really fast so that's really good. And then during the day we've been keeping them on this side of the fence so that then that gives us a chance to clean that side of the fence. They can spend the day and then they also have been using the dog door really well so that um, decreases the amount of cleaning we have to do during the day. And since we're down here a lot more during the day and stuff that we can um, clean up easier and keep an eye on them easier. And then at nighttime we move them back into there and then we clean this half of the room. So it's been working really well. Sometimes they get their front feet in the litter box but not their back. But it's okay. I mean they got the idea so that's important. Hi. Come back in Dasher. Little puppies tend to like to stay inside. They don't usually go outside very much. But it's also just harder for them to push that door open, so. Ouch, they are gnawing on my feet. this morning that when he came in um, there was no poop in the sleeping area there was um, no poop on the floor in this next area right here behind me so there are some in the litter box and then over here there was like one or two messes just outside the litter box but they did awesome last night I mean for 25 puppies to all poop in the, like to almost all poop in the litter box except for like three it's awesome but uh but it's good because the future owners are going to um, hopefully be able to build on that um, experience and be able to um, train them more easily. Some of the puppies are outside. It's been fairly cold lately, but um, these Bernadoodle puppies don't seem to care. They love it outside, but um, they're doing really good with going in and out of the dog door. So we keep an eye on them, but um, it's nice to be able to let them. Cupid, are you going to go outside? We stapled that um, hospital pad to the door to help with the cold. Spruce, you can figure it out. <laughs> but anyway, so it's good for them to get to go outside, go potty, and go poop. There she goes. <laughs> I spilled your water everywhere. See, there's mittens going. Going in the litter box. What a good girl. Comes Christmas. There goes Parka. So this is honestly really subdued for them. They're about ready for their nap. 
Um, they've been playing and going outside all morning. So, what's two doing? Chewing on the carpet. Puppy, puppy, puppies! Blitz in. Oh, oh, here they all come. I'm inside their pen because they chew on my feet. Um, but anyway, this is like, they're all going to probably fall asleep right here by the fireplace. It's where they like to sleep. And while they take a nap, we're going to do homeschool. After their nap, we'll let the mama dogs in, they'll nurse, um, and we'll probably do some work with the puppies, maybe do some training, and um, let them have a big playtime and stuff, and then they'll take a nap and we'll do it all over again. Polar, what? Hello. Aw, the golden doodle puppies went in their pen. They like comfort. Tinsel. Most of them know that they can even go inside of it. <laughs> oh my golden doodle puppy just pulled it over on himself. That's hilarious. These two doppelgangers here hanging out with me. So this one, Blitzen, and this one is Coco. Yeah, it's your sweet boy. But they're from two different litters. They look the same. Hear the other dogs barking. Hi, Cupid. I better go upstairs and help Brian with the schoolwork. <laughs> left open and so all these puppies came upstairs which is fine we just weren't able to make sure that they went potty outside yet so we've had a few messes haven't we Jordan yeah. but they're learning just a little hard should we take them back downstairs guys getting a bath today. I am. Tinsel! Puppy, puppy, puppy! Hey, Tinsel! Come here! It's time to get a bath! Tinsel! Come on, puppy! Time for a bath! Come on! You're gonna go to your new home tomorrow! You're gonna get a bath today! Oh, good girl. I'm 
commotion and dogs were fighting over something and I think I saw oh it's a squirrel oh it's still alive you guys are terrible that's awful so here's the problem they're fighting over it and I don't want them to eat it What did you guys do? That's disgusting, Denali. How do I get it away from them? The puppies are spending a little time outside. I got Akira in. I couldn't get Denali in, obviously, for obvious reasons. Akira's got blood on her lip. It's either from the squirrel or from fighting over the squirrel. Poor girl. I don't. It was a cold, wild winter. You were sleeping on my shoulder. I was praying that the raging storm would stay a little longer with your feet up on the dashboard of my summer dream in Westwood. I was hoping. To the softest of spring mornings, humming do 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 videos that I just gave them all supper and um, we took them outside and they went potty and all of that and they did awesome and I totally forgot to take any videos but to let you know what happened um, so they were all sleeping right here and then I woke them up from the nap and we took them outside and they went potty awesome all of them went potty and then we brought them back in I brought them back in and then um, fed them their supper and then took them back outside and they all went poop and um, like all of them we didn't have any accidents <laughs> The floor is all perfectly clean. It's super great. So I feel like it's just a good lesson in like consistency and routine. And if you just know when to take a puppy outside, then they'll go. And it helps that we have a huge group of puppies because they all kind of like feed off of each other. But potty training really isn't that hard. Um, just as long as you're consistent and you read their cues. We got the fire going. The puppies are playing. <coughs> oh, Ronnie. If you don't like the puppies, just go upstairs. She keeps coming down here. She can go upstairs whenever she wants. But she comes down here and then she gets all mad at all the puppies when they try to nurse. thing for the day. We're gonna let the mama dogs in. Let them nurse. Right, back up, back up, back up. Oh 
boy. Denali, come! They spilled water all over the place. So that's great. They're stuck. Help me help you. Come on, puppies, come on. Come on, Donner, you can go over the fence. Come on, Donner. Puppy, 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 puppy. Come on. Come on, puppy, 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 puppy. Figure it out. No, Christmas, don't go out. What are you guys doing in here? Come on, puppies, puppies, puppies. Come on. So I was coming in here to check, make sure all the puppies are gone. <laughs> this little dirt. What are you doing, Tinsel? Tinsel! Hey! <laughs> Just all nestled in there. Nelly.